Yo, this is Pierce Robertson. I'm spitting straight facts on MLBBro.com. Growing up black in baseball means you're indoctrinated with the tales of the Negro Leagues, of men like Cool Papa Bell, Rube Foster, Satchel Paige, and Ted Double Duty Ratcliffe. And while you knew on the field they were equal to their white counterparts in Major League Baseball, it was unmistakable how much the powers that be wanted to keep them separate. Once MLB began allowing black and brown ball players, it served as a death knell to more than a half century of the Negro Leagues. This week, MLB combined statistics from the various Negro Leagues with its official record book. The move has been hailed as a historic step to rectify a long-standing oversight. But what's done is done. The addition doesn't change history. It can't put Josh Gibson in a Pirates uniform to stand across from Bullet Rogan of the Royals. It can't wash away MLB's role in maintaining the color line or change the lives of the men who endured the injustices of segregation and racism. And just because MLB is finally acknowledging the legacy of the Negro Leagues, it doesn't mean it didn't exist before. The positive here, hopefully more people are inclined to open their eyes to greatness. This is Pierce. Those are straight facts on MLBBro.com. MLBBro.com, covering black and brown major leagues.